Gerald, this seems very odd in a, in a sense because where he first reported or, or phoned in uh, to um, his friend to say that he he was needing water and that he'd cut his foot or his leg, he was in an area that was wasn't really so remote. So why, why are they having trouble to finding him? It just seems a bit odd. Well, we don't know. We, we obviously don't know if after that call he stayed put or he moved on from there. Um, very likely he moved on, um, and and so the the, the, the police are you know um, go, going on that. Uh, but it is a very very difficult terrain. Uh, again, I've just spoken to the police. The operation and search operation is continuing very much in the same way. It has now been going on uh, for a week, um, but lots of places he could fall, have an accident, um, and his behaviour wasn't wasn't entirely predictable. Um, we know he wanted to get a bus back to the south, uh, and yet he was seen walking away from the village in the opposite direction after stopping a neighbour to ask for for the bus timetables. So that also goes against the um, is, is is another problem for the police, an added problem. He'd been at a rave, hadn't he, uh, Gerard, uh, with some mates, and there's a lot of footage emerged. But what I find really strange, is all the stories today are running um, uh, stories about how his mother, who was out there looking for him, as you'd expect any mother to do, she's being trolled on social media. You think, is nothing sacred anymore? I mean, why would anybody turn on a mother who's desperately looking for her 19-year-old son who's been missing for the best part of a week? What is the matter with people? It's absolutely awful. Um, you know, these people just need to get a life. Um, you know, the, she flew out. Debbie flew out immediately. She was she was told the news. She hasn't been up to the to the scene, but that's because she 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 openly admits she'd find it uh, she uh, too upsetting. Um, but she's there, and you know, to be receiving this sort of criticism on top of the nightmare she's already enduring, it, it just beggars belief. Yeah, now she's also asked that British police could assist um, to help overcome problems with language and so on and so forth. But what could they honestly do if they did assist? I mean, they don't know the terrain. What, what use would they be? I mean, it's a per my, my personal opinion is that the um, work on, on, uh, on the ground is best left to the, to the local police, the mountain experts who, 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 know, who know the area. I think maybe the uh, British police would be an extra helping hand when it comes to issues of language um, and perhaps a presence there would maybe encourage uh, British speaking people to come forward uh, with with information they may have. So I can understand the mother, um, Debbie, wanting to everything possible to be done uh, and, and, and that if necessary, you know, uh, be in the presence of British police. Um, it's a very emotionally charged situation, but I think the Spanish police are you know, handling it well, albeit in a very different manner to the way the British police would, would be doing, which is maybe to be um, publicly making an appeal alongside the family. The Spanish Guardia Civil just do not do things this way. They're quietly working away in the background um, and, and, and focused, as they told me this morning when I just spoke to them, totally 100% focused uh, on, on the work they're doing. Um, Gerard, the thing that worries all of us watching is the heat. Uh, we're now in um, nearly in July. Uh, there's even a prospect of some sunny weather in England, for mm. God's sake. How hot is it now in Tenerife? Yeah, I mean, obviously it's uh, very hot, uh, but also the temperatures drop uh, towards the night time. So mm. this is this is the problem. Uh, and he wasn't dressed, uh, you know, to experience those sort of temperature differences. Um, and we know he didn't have water, so he's. Uh, he doesn't know the terrain, and as far as I know, he's no expert in the mountains, so all that is going against him. Um, so it is very, very, very concerning, obviously primarily for his family and friends, but for everyone else uh, who, is, who, is, who is watching this and, and just hoping that, that it has a successful outcome and that he's found well and you know, safe and well. But with every day that passes, mm. you know, realistically, that, 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 that uh, possibility becomes less and less.